Hello friends and family from Universal City Walk. It is such a beautiful day outside today. I figure it'd be fun to come out here to Universal Studios, actually do a little bit of Harry Potter shopping here at Universal City Walk. I do want to go over to the main Universal Studios store here on City Walk and show you guys all of the awesome Harry Potter merchandise they have. There are some incredible offerings here and you don't even need a park ticket to go over there and shop. You could just come here to City Walk, do all of your Harry Potter shopping. They have everything from your wands to your robes and pretty much everything they sell here in the parks. But before we get started, if you would subscribe and click the bell notification so you wear future uploads and live streams, we would greatly appreciate it. This is what we're dealing with here today on City Walk. Like I was saying, it is so beautiful outside. Just enjoying the Hollywood Rip Ride rocket over there. And uh, yeah, look at the globe today. I can't get enough of this here on City Walk. Definitely very, very beautiful today. Like I was saying, the great thing about Universal City Walk, if you actually come after 6 p.m., I believe, you could actually park for free. You don't even need to go to the parks if you don't want to. Like, City Walk is completely free at that point. You don't have to pay for parking. You can come here, do all of your shopping, and enjoy all of the restaurants here that Universal City Walk has to offer. And here it is, the main Universal Studios store here on City Walk. Like I was saying, they have a great selection of Wizarding World of Harry Potter merchandise, but you can actually get a little bit of everything else in here as well, like your Simpsons, E.T., a little bit of everything. So as soon as you come in here, you're greeted by some awesome Wizarding World of Harry Potter spirit jerseys. Look at this. This is the Gryffindor one. These are $70 a piece. I do want to show you the back of this because it's actually embroidered Gryffindor. These are really good quality. They have some stripes there on the side, but they do have these for all of the different houses. Over here is the Ravenclaw one. Like I said, these are just really, really nice. Like everything is embroidered. Definitely a very nice spirit jersey. And then over here is a lot of really fun Looks like all Gryffindor merchandise. Over here, Determination, Gryffindor, Courage, and Bravery. These coffee mugs are really nice. Those are $20 a piece, and they do have the matching t-shirts right underneath. These are really cool, though. Look at that again. Courage, Determination, and Bravery. $35 for those. Looks like they also have all that merchandise in Hufflepuff as well, saying dedication, patience, and loyalty. It does say Hufflepuff inside of these coffee mugs. These are really nice though, only $20. And they do say Wizarding World of Harry Potter right underneath, like that is really cool. And they do have some really fun hats that I wanna show you guys. This one here, of course, is the uh, Hufflepuff hat with the embroidered uh, Hufflepuff crest there. These ones actually say Hufflepuff on the backside, $27 a piece for those. And it does look like they have an awesome little kid's shirt here again. You have patience, dedication, and loyalty. These ones here are $30 a piece. There's even a bunch of really fun Quidditch gear here. These are the Ravenclaw hats. Look at this Ravenclaw keeper. It's embroidered there, Ravenclaw. It even has Hogwarts Quidditch. Like these are so soft as well. Those are $27 a piece. Over here is the Gryffindor keeper. Again, the same type of hat, just a different house. And they do actually have a lot of really nice Quidditch shirts here. Again, Gryffindor keeper. Again, that's all embroidered on there. These ones are $40 a piece. But look at this. You have a Hogwarts little patch there that says Quidditch. Over here is the uh, Ravenclaw one. Then I do want to, of course, show you guys the Slytherin and Hufflepuff because these are really cool. Here's the uh, Slytherin Keeper one. And then they do have the Hufflepuff one here as well. And all of the uh, t-shirts there. Look at this one. Here's the uh, Slytherin Keeper t-shirt for that whole collection. But they have a whole section here of unique merchandise. And again, a lot of this section is actually Quidditch. I like this uh, Ravenclaw zip up. Look at this. Like, I like how it zips from that direction. The pocket area is just so nice on these. These ones here are $65 a piece. And it does say Ravenclaw Hogwarts on the backside. Like, that is really cool. Then check out these cups that they have. They have like a clear lid there. And these are actually stainless steel. You get a big... Uh, a big crest there of Ravenclaw. Those are $32 a piece. And they do have a couple other options actually for drinkware. This is like a plastic uh, Ravenclaw one. It says Wizarding World of Harry Potter Ravenclaw. Those are $12 a piece. And there's some more hats that we haven't seen yet. These ones here are the Ravenclaw Team Quidditch Captain hats. Those ones are $27. Definitely actually a really fun hat. 
and they do have this one. I do believe this might be new. Look at that Ravenclaw Hogwarts. This is like a Under Armour material. $37, but that'd be really nice for the parks. And then they do have that over here in like a, a women's tank top, which is really nice. That one there is $37, but they do have those literally like for every single house. Like over here is your Slytherin uh, zip up right there. They have the Slytherin cups there with the uh, house crest, which are really nice. But check out these steins that they have. I have to show you guys these. These are so nice. Look at the Slytherin crest there. The snake actually has jewels on its eyes. Those are $30 a piece and I love these. Like those are way cool. And they do have some Wizarding World of Harry Potter collectible coins. You could actually do like your very own pressed penny. Looks like they have quite a bit of offerings there with all of the houses. It looks like you have Dobby, the uh, house crest as well, and platform nine and three quarters. There's also other huge selection over here, like these Gryffindor bags are actually really nice. Those are $45. They say Hogwarts all over them. Gryffindor on the front, like that is really cool. Actually has a lot of zipper compartments. And then over here is a really nice uh, cinch backpack. Again, they do have these for all of the houses. It looks like they're just uh, having the Gryffindor stuff in the front at the moment, but that one there is $28. And then right underneath those ones, they have the Slytherin uh, purses. And then right down there is another cinch backpack. That one is the Slytherin one. I do want to show you though, we have to check these guys out. This is like a simulated leather, like a card holder. Like these are really nice for the parks. These are $28 a piece. They have the Gryffindor, Slytherin there, Ravenclaw, and Hufflepuff. But those are actually really nice. Like I like how bright those colors are. Down here is a really fun t-shirt with all of the Hogwarts crests there. These are $35 a piece. It actually says Hogwarts on there. Like that is really nice. And then over here is actually a men's tank top. Gryffindor, Slytherin, Ravenclaw, Hufflepuff. Let's see here how much these guys are. Those ones are only $30 a piece. And there's actually a really nice synthetic leather feel a picture frame. It holds a 5x7 or a 4x6 photo, $29 for those ones, and they do have some really nice socks here. You get one pair, but they do have your Gryffindor, Slytherin, Ravenclaw, and Hufflepuff. Those are all $17 a piece, and here's actually those plastic cups I showed you, all the different houses that they actually have. One thing I find really interesting though, is like the Ravenclaw, like this purse here, a side bag, again, $45, but look how much different the color blue is compared to the uh, cinch backpack. That's definitely interesting. Even some really nice women's long sleeve shirts, and these are actually so soft. Look at all the jewels there. This one here is the Hufflepuff one. These are like so super soft though, like I love these. And then over here, I do want to show you some of the other houses they have in these. This one is the Ravenclaw one. Again, they have these in all different houses. And check out these little backpacks that they have. Those jewel tees are $38.99. They also have some synthetic leather, like very small backpacks here. Again, with the Ravenclaw house crest. I do want to check the price on these. Those ones are $65 a piece, but they have Ravenclaw there. Over here you have your Slytherin backpack, and then Gryffindor, Hufflepuff is hanging out over there. I like this one though, I, I am a Gryffindor, but I like the color of the crest on that one. And I do like the zipper pulls as well. Reminds me of like little pygmy puffs. There's also lots of really fun plushies here. Look at the lion, it's actually wearing a Gryffindor scarf and it's embroidered on there. Like that is so adorable. Those ones are $30 a piece. They're actually a pretty good size for a plushie as well. And then look at this one down here. <laughs> look at them. There's nothing like a Harry Potter on this one, but that is really interesting. Like that is really cool. And then over here are those really awesome adult size uh, pullover sweatshirts. The Gryffindor one is so cool. It says Gryffindor down the sleeve. I love these though. I'm not seeing the price on those, but those are actually really good quality. And they do have a kid's version where the Gryffindor is actually embroidered on there. And then over here, you actually have like the Gryffindor house crest. Like those are really cool. And then over here is the uh, Slytherin version of those. This is the adult size right here with the uh, Slytherin patch. And then it says Slytherin down the arm. Then here's the uh, one for the kiddos. Definitely really nice, very soft pullover sweatshirts. And they do have some plushies here for Slytherin. Look at that, $30 for the snake. It actually has a Slytherin scarf on that actually has a little Slytherin tag. Like that is so adorable. And then you have some other little snakes over here. Kind of like that little lion we saw. Very interesting. 
I do also like a lot of this merchandise over here. This actually looks like your ticket. It says London to Hogwarts, and then the other side says Hogwarts to London. This is a really nice size women's wallet. These are actually $30 a piece. These aren't lounge fly, but these are actually really good quality. And then they do have the uh, matching backpacks over here. It says number 257 for your one-way travel, London to Hogwarts. That backpack is actually really nice. I like all the color contrast. Those are $65 a piece. And then over over here it looks like they have some like uh, coin pouches again with your ticket there London to Hogwarts $20 a piece for these ones and they do have some trays over here with your Hogwarts ticket which is really cool look at that though it actually says ticket to be shown upon demand like that is so neat $24 for these ceramic uh, trinket trays I love those though definitely really good quality then check out the uh, smaller backpacks just like the house crest ones this one actually has all four houses on it for $98 they also have these much larger size backpacks with your embroidered lion there. This is the Gryffindor one. I do like the uh, quilted pattern. These are Wizarding World of Harry Potter Danielle Nicole bags. This one here is $82. Yeah, these are $82 a piece. Like that is really cool. That's the Slytherin one. And then right underneath, they actually have the matching fanny packs to these. These are really nice quality. $68 a piece for the fanny packs. It says Danielle Nicole there on the other side. And again, the Slytherin is actually embroidered on there. For $25, they also have some really nice Hogwarts Railways little journals. These are really cool though. Again, $25 for those, but I love the theming and like all the embroidery on there. Like that is really neat. Then over here, what do we have? This is from the films of Harry Potter, travel magic, artifacts from the Wizarding World. Oh wow, look at that. That actually comes with all of those things there. Looks like you got the Spectro Specs, the Chocolate Frog. That is really interesting. I don't think I've ever seen these before. Let's check out the price on those. $24.99 for them. Then over here is an awesome platform, nine and three quarters pillow. And I love this. Like this is embroidered and so soft. Those are $45 a piece. And it does look like they have like a tin wall sign here as well. It says platform nine and three quarters. Like that is really amazing. And they do have some woven uh, throw blankets here with the Hogwarts Express on it. Again, these are just very, very good quality. It says Hogwarts Express right there. Definitely very nice. Looks like they also have a lot of merchandise here with the uh, dark mark symbol. Like, look how cool these cups are. Like, I love this. Look at all the green colors there. Those are really amazing, actually. Let's see, those ones are $27 a piece. And then over here, just like all the Hogwarts houses, it looks like they also have the dark mark cup. Did the plastic ones say Wizarding World of Harry Potter, Universal Studios, those are $12. They even have a dark mark trucker hat. This one looks amazing, actually, with all the colors there. And that's actually like the uh, spell that you can cast over in the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Those are $29 a piece. And they even have a coffee mug here. How fun is all of this merchandise? Again, with the spell there. It looks like these are actually the ones, though, when you put a hot liquid in, they actually change color. Those are $25 a piece. And they do have a bunch of uh, really nice Wizarding World of Harry Potter Dark Mark merchandise. This definitely gives some major Slytherin vibes. $38 for this one. And then look at this one here. This is a nice uh, pullover sweatshirt. Again, with the Dark Mark. That one there is 65 bucks, and I love that. They even have a really nice long sleeve women's sequence uh, Deathly Hollow symbol shirt. Like, look at that. The whole symbol there is actually all sequins and all of the sleeves. That is $65. Definitely very shiny. And they have a long sleeve button up shirt again with the uh, Deathly Hollow symbol. This one's really fun. $70 for that one. And it looks like they actually have some Noble Collection merchandise over in the section. This is the Tom Riddle Diary. And these are like exact replicas from the movie. $42 and 95 cents for that one and they even have some death eater masks over here those guys here are 30 dollars but like how fun is that i'd love to be a death eater for halloween also for 27 dollars they have a really awesome deathly hollows hat which is embroidered there on the front it says that deathly hollows there on the back as well like that is really cool they do have some backpacks down here as well like this one is actually like a simulated leather definitely a much smaller size bag but definitely perfect for the parks 
Let's see, that one there is $65, but the leather quality feels really good on that. Over here is a really fun Deathly Hollows pillow. These ones are really soft though. That is $29 for that one. And then also down here, look at the size of this one. This is a very nice backpack. Again, with the Deathly Hollow symbol, lots of zipper compartments. $75 for that one. And they even have a clear little purse here. This one is only $32. That is really nice though. Actually, it looks like a fanny pack or a purse. Like that's really cool. Even for $21, they have some Wizarding World of Harry Potter cauldron coffee mugs, and it's actually branded there, Wizarding World of Harry Potter right underneath. Those ones are really fun. But over here is actually, each section is kind of partitioned to its own section. Like over here is the uh, Hufflepuff section. They have some really fun backpacks with a tie. Again, a great size for the parks. But a lot of really good merchandise here, like the uh, hats that say Hufflepuff, it's embroidered on there. Definitely really nice for winter. Those are $30 a piece. Right underneath for $22, they have some really nice winter gloves. Again, embroidered there, which are really nice. And also check out the uh, scarves that they have with the Wizarding World of Harry Potter tag. Definitely very good quality, $40 for those. And I do want to point out the awesome wall banners that they have here as well. And again, everything is actually embroidered. I like the frillies there on the bottom. It says dedication, Hufflepuff, patience and loyalty like that is really cool you got the Hufflepuff cup down there and of course you can actually purchase your Wizarding World of Harry Potter robes it looks like the Hufflepuff ones go up to a four extra small all the way up to a 2x I do want to show you these though like these are simply the best of quality you got your Hufflepuff logo right there and they do have a compartment actually on the inside where you can put your wand like how cool is that you can hide your wand inside there and then cast spells inside of the park like I was saying though, they do have all of that merchandise for each house. Like over here is the Ravenclaw, they have those really fun purses. And then like the uh, scarves, hats, and gloves, all the way to your Ravenclaw robes. Then over here is the whole Slytherin section, again with all of that same merchandise. And then down here you have all of the uh, Gryffindor. This section here actually has one of the most adorable Wizarding World of Harry Potter plushies I think I've ever seen. You have a bear, he's actually wearing Harry's Christmas sweater. It's embroidered on his foot there, Harry Potter. Those are $40 a piece, those are amazing. Down here is some awesome Hogwarts alumni merchandise. This t-shirt has a striped pattern on either sleeve. Hogwarts alumni, those ones are $37. And they do have like a v-neck version over here in a heather gray color for $37. $7. But I do want to point out some of the other fun merchandise here with all of the house crest. Again, a Hogwarts alumni book. These are $24 a piece. I love how shiny silver they are with all of the houses there. And then over here is a really fun stainless steel cup with all the different houses as well. It says Hogwarts alumni. Those are $25 a piece. They do have also a lot of really unique Honey Dukes merchandise. Like look at these uh, hot pads. Those are $15 a piece. I love all the bright colors on those. Right underneath is a really good size like soup mug we'll call this one. Because that is absolutely enormous. With the uh, Honey Dukes logo, $21 for those ones. But they do actually have like lots of really fancy plates like this one. Again with all the Honey Dukes colors, $17 for those. And I love that. Like those are really amazing. But look at this they even have like the birdie bots every flavored bean ones right there and then right underneath is actually a very large size bowl or you could probably even use this for a trinket tray for birdie bots every flavored bean those ones are actually $25 but look at over here they actually have some uh, Honey Dukes measuring spoons, those are 25 bucks, but those are really cool. Each of them actually has the Honey Dukes logo and it tells you how many teaspoons those are, but these are ceramic. And then right underneath is a really fun lounge fly bag with the Harry Potter lounge fly tag. Like these are so cool. Like actually like the chocolate frog there and a lot of the different snacks and whatnot. $82 for that one. And this one over here is actually dedicated solely to like Honey Dukes. It has an embroidered tag there, exploding bomb bonbons, pumpkin juice, lots of really fun stuff all over this bag. That one there is $82. They do actually have a huge selection of like different kitchen items 
like look at this huge tray again with all the hogwarts houses it says hogwarts on it definitely very shiny these are 30 dollars a piece for those but they do actually have some really nice sized dishes that i want to show you and again these are all like a heavy ceramic i love all the gold accents on there they just look truly incredible wizarding world of harry potter on the back those are 17 dollars a piece for the dishes but they actually have like coffee mugs and other clear glass drinkware here as well again all of the hogwarts uh, houses are just surrounding there with all the gold accents those are 19 dollars and like i was saying a couple different options here actually with drinkware i like the size of this one and again with all the gold accents yet again those are 17 dollars and they do have some salt and pepper shakers here with the uh, hogwarts house crest $12 a piece. These are really nice though. Definitely a very fancy set. I always like to check out a lot of the different Wizarding World of Harry Potter Christmas ornaments because they are all so unique. Look at this, the Monster Book of Monsters. The attention to detail like on this is amazing. That there is $25. I love this though. I would totally get this for my tree. And then over here, they actually have a sorting hat as well. These ones are $25. Again, just very good quality. The attention to detail definitely looks very, very realistic on there. And then they also have one here for $19 for the uh, Three Broomsticks restaurant that you can actually dine at here at the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Like that one is so much fun. Over here is a new one, I do believe, from the uh, Hogshead. You can actually get a Hogshead beverage over there in a Hogsmeade village. Like that is really cool. And then you actually have a metal one here with the uh, sign from Hogsmeade actually as soon as you enter Hogsmeade like that is amazing like I said just lots and lots of really fun offerings and look at this one this is actually uh, Harry Potter's acceptance letter to Hogwarts it even has the wax seal those are $17 a piece and you even have Hedwig right there on the uh, cart for $24 I definitely have to show this one though. This ornament is enormous. Now look at this. It's actually a Hogwarts suitcase and it opens up. Like you can actually store stuff inside of there. Like how interesting is that? And they do have all of the different houses have their very own Christmas stocking. These are $35 a piece. Definitely really good premium feel. You have your Slytherin. Over there is Gryffindor, Ravenclaw, and then Hufflepuff. The colors are definitely very vibrant though. Like these are really nice. This section here has some really nice wooden wall art. These are $39 a piece, but these are seriously like a couple feet tall. You have Slytherin, Ravenclaw, and Hufflepuff here at the moment. I love those though. Like those are very, very heavy. So if you are purchasing these, I would get these definitely on the way out. Over here though, like look at these. These are Wizarding World of Harry Potter Noble Collection wall crest. And these are so nice. This is the actual Slytherin one. Like there's all the different houses you can get. You have your Gryffindor, Slytherin, Ravenclaw, Hufflepuff, and then you can get the actual house crest. It does look like they actually have all of these here at the moment. Definitely a great way to decorate your Harry Potter room. A few other really nice hats here. Here's a really nice trucker hat. It's embroidered Hogwarts with all of the different houses there. This one here is $29. Then they have yet another really fun offering. Again, with all those really nice gold accents with all the Hogwarts houses. I just love the gold accents. It's embroidered Hogwarts on the other side. Those are $29 as well. And they do also have some really nice Hogwarts uh, t-shirts here. This one is $37 with the Hogwarts crest and actually says Hogwarts. Hogwarts going down the entire shirt, but it looks like they have a, uh, a pullover full zip as well. I should say a full zip with the Hogwarts house crest. These ones are $80 a piece. Oh, look at the backside. It actually says Hogwarts. That is way cool. I love that. They do also have an entire section here, which is actually all like uh, Noble Collection Harry Potter merchandise. Helena Bohm Carter actually signed this 8x10, and you have one of her wands there, $1,250. But check out this gigantic sculpture of Gringotts Bank, just like you'll see over in Diagon Alley. That there is $450. Again, the attention to detail on some of these items is seriously like next level amazing. You can actually purchase the Noble Collection sorcerer's stone there it comes encased with that glass that's a hundred dollars over here is a really fun dobby bookend for sixty dollars like look at him though like he's all hand painted you have a cage back there with hedwig in it for 85 dollars and even that classic scene on the wizarding world of harry potter you gotta love that though where dobby gets his sock out of the book 120 dollars for that one and even have the 
very own Tri-Wizard Egg down there for $73. Definitely a lot of really fun merchandise here. You can even purchase Bellatrix Lestrange's mask, which actually comes mounted on this uh, piece of wood from the Noble Collection and does have her actual name on a little nameplate there. That is $110. They also have the Noble Collection mirror of Erised. That there is $95. And right underneath, they have Lucius Malfoy's mask, just like they have the Bellatrix Lestrange one. Like, that one is amazing. And over here, you actually have uh, Luna Lovegood's Love Potion, which actually comes encapsulated there. There. Definitely a very, very unique necklace. I love that right there. Like, that is really cool. And they do have the Deathly Hollows necklace right behind it. That there is $58. They do have a couple other really nice coffee mugs I want to show you. The, again, these are the ones where you actually add a hot liquid. They do change color. It says Wizarding World of Harry Potter, Universal Studios. But on the other side, you have the actual Marauders map. A very good sized coffee mug. That one's $25. And then you have yet another one right over here. It says, I solemnly swear that I'm up to no good. Like, how fun is this? And then you actually have the Marauders map logo. This one here is $21. And a couple other fun offerings right underneath those look at this this one is sun activated design again with the uh, marauders map i solemnly swear i'm up to no good that one there is 40 dollars, and these are actually really soft they do have a uh, a full zip hoodie as well of the marauders map and this is a very uh, soft very thin lightweight material 62 dollars for those Looks like they actually have a lot of really nice uh, Marauder's Map sun activated stuff. This uh, tank top here is 37 bucks. Again, it says, I solemnly swear that I'm up to no good. Like that one is really cool. And they even have a Marauder's Map 300 piece puzzle. <laughs> that is really neat though. Definitely lots of unique merchandise here at the Wizarding World. Those there are $22 a piece. And if you'd like to take home your very own Marauder's Map actual Noble Collection prop, these again are the best of quality. They actually open up and they do give you this nice carrying case for it. That there is $49.95 for that one. And then they have another version over here which actually comes with a wand. It says uh, tap the wand on I solemnly swear uh, that I'm up to no good to let the fun begin. That actually sounds really interesting. This whole set is $59.95 for that one. But I do want to point out a really awesome uh, button-up shirt that they have here for Weasley wizard wheezes these ones are $70 a piece but look at the attention to detail like how fun are those and of course you can get your awesome wizarding world of Harry Potter snacks here like your fudge flies these are chocolate covered fudge flies those are really fun these are actually really delicious definitely my favorite snack though at the wizarding world are the fizzing whizbies made with chocolate fizzy fruits that is really cool. I love the packaging of these though. Those are only $11 a piece. If you haven't tried anything yet, definitely try the Fizzing Whizbees. Like those ones are so delicious. And then check out the really awesome packaging on the extendable ears, earphone included it says. Like how cool is that? Like I love that. It actually extends up to 12 feet. Those are $25 a piece. Of course they do offer a lot of other Wizarding World of Harry Potter snacks. They have Birdie Bots Every Flavored Beans. You gotta test your luck here and uh, make sure you get the right bean but the packaging again is impeccable those are $13 a piece and over here like these ones are actually really nice these come in a really nice honey dukes plastic container and it's very very good quality like I love those it actually says honey dukes there on the front those are $25 for those and they are filled with the candies like those are really cool and then right down here I do want to show you some artificial sweeteners that they have for your drinks they have Luna Love Goods Love Potion $9.95 for that one and then right next door they actually have the Felix Felices for your uh, liquid luck $11 for those ones look at the whole vial you get like that is really fun and you can mix and match the uh, chocolate frogs they now have milk chocolate and dark chocolate and of course the uh, wizarded wizarding cards are included inside of those but those are three for $35 for $82, they have this awesome Harry Potter lounge fly bag. You can actually see the castle right there. It has a really nice lounge fly zipper pull. Hedwig's hanging out right up there. Like, this is so much fun. And then 
check out the back of there. It says Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry, but that feels very premium, the quality of that one. And I do want to show you the really fun purse that they have here as well. You get like a felt um, headwig tag there and all of the castle is embroidered on there. This is really nice though. Then again, a Harry Potter lounge fly purse. This one is $82. Then they have some mugs over here. It says, let's see what we have here. Visiting Enchanting Hogsmeade. Yeah, that's really cool. Just like the entrance to Hogsmeade Village. And then you actually have Hogwarts Castle. $19 for those. And they do actually have the uh, matching t-shirt to that as well. So that actually matches the cup right there. It's $27 for those. But it actually says Wizarding World of Harry Potter on the sleeve. Like that is great attention to detail. A couple other fun items here. They actually have your very own Triwizard Cup. And this actually lights up. It has like a little pull tab right underneath. And the cup lights up. These are $25 a piece. These are really nice though. Noble Collection actually makes one. But this one is actually just as cool. Like that one's really neat. And they do have lots of Wizarding World of Harry Potter plushies over here I want to show you. Look at this one. This one's actually new. It says Hedwig and then Pidgewidge. And you get both of those characters. $35 for those. Up here is a big plushie of Aragog the uh, spider look at the size of that like that is so cool I love this though look at him look at him with all of his beady eyes for $82 is yet another really awesome lounge flight bag this is fantastic beast and where to find them this whole thing is so fuzzy though look at all the jewels that the uh, Niffler collected it says fantastic beast there on the side again $82 for those that's really fuzzy too like I love that and they have lots of different fantastic beast plushies look at all the bow truckles hanging out down here isn't that really cool and these are posable as well which is really neat they do even have lots of different notebooks and things look at this wizarding world of Harry Potter this is a quill stand and ink set you actually get everything like the whole setup just like the movies those are $43 a piece like that is really cool then also like a lot of uh, like limited edition journals this one here actually says it's lined it says a history of magic but filled the bag shot that one is $25 and then over here there's yet another really fun one look at this Hogwarts a history again wasn't that really amazing though with all the Hogwarts houses like that one is really cool definitely my favorite of the bunch though like I'm a big fan of the monster book of monsters and this is a plushy journal which is embroidered there monster book of monsters $32 you have his tongue sticking out and his teeth like that one is just something else and they do have a bunch of different book marks and ink pen sets that they have a lot of different characters actually like this one here they have Ginny Weasley Luna Lovegood they have Severus Snape right there let's see who else they have actually Ron Weasley Lucius Malfoy Voldemort and Draco Malfoy these are really nice though definitely a nice little take home I also don't think I've ever seen these pens before. Look at those. Like, these are really nice. And check out the packaging they actually come in. They say Wizarding World of Harry Potter, Hogwarts, ballpoint pen. It looks like they actually come with the charm. Those are all $22 a piece. Definitely amazing. And they do have some more Harry Potter Noble Collection items over here. These are like the Gringotts coins. You get all three of the coins, the Certificate of Authenticity, and this really nice case that they come in. Like, that is a lot of fun. Like, I love these so much. And then right underneath there, look at these down here. They have some Hogwarts gift bags. <laughs> these are really good quality though. Like these feel so heavy. Looks like you get a bunch of them though. Nine dollars and you get three different gift bags. Like those are really fun. And then right up here, I also want to show you this. Birdie Bot's Every Flavored Bean Set. It looks like you get an ink pen, some ribbon, a bunch of uh, paper clips. Those are thirty dollars a piece. It also looks like they moved all of the Wizarding World of Harry Potter pins over here to the spinny rack. And they're all a great price actually compared to Disney prices. Here's a really fun one of Dobby holding a sock. That one is $9. Look at this one here. It actually says Dobby is free. Again, he's holding a sock there for $11. I do want to check out some of the other different offerings they have over here on this rack. Here's a really fun one. It says Quidditch from Hogwarts with all the different house colors. $9 for that one. Like that is really neat. And check out this giant enormous one of Fluffy the three-headed dog it actually has a little ribbon there that says Fluffy but that is only nine bucks like that is such a crazy good deal and they even have a golden snitch pin which is very nice metallic in color that one is twelve dollars I do want to see what else we have over here on this rack though I remember this pin when Hagrid's magical creatures motorbike adventure was actually first coming out that one is eight dollars and then over here is the signage for Nocturne Alley like how fun is that just like you'll 
you'll see over in Diagon Alley. That one is $9. I had such a great time today hanging out at Universal City Walk. Lots of fun things happening, but I always love checking out the main Universal Studios store. Like I was saying, they literally sell like all of the Wizarding World of Harry Potter merchandise. I always suggest like you guys do your fun day in the park and do your shopping at the end here on City Walk so that you're not carrying the items around with you all day. But I had such a great time today. If you'd like to further support the channel, please consider checking out our Patreon Patreon page. I'll let a link in the description box of this video, but if you like today's video, give it a big thumbs up. And as always, make today awesome.